anything, 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 anything. We do what dons do, longest nanny, anything. So as always, we always start with last week's question, which was what city slash country would you like to see the Dons come to if we were to tour? Let's have a butchers. Now, as you know, we have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of comments. I can only select a handful. So these are ones I've pulled out this week. We've got Lestin Phillips and Hamza Khan. They're showing love from Wales. We've got everyone in Wales. Dragon business. We've got Cameron and Mitchell Tweed shouting from Scotland. Big up all the Scotsmen. Dazzling Economics is saying, come to Dubai. Who wants to sponsor the journey? Jamal is saying that the Don should come to Afghanistan. He's writing from Kabul, we love that. Now we're also getting loads of love coming from the United States of America. We've got Jason K, Jaden, Richie B and Football, all from different parts of the States. I will let a secret come out. Me, Big G and Chris, we're coming to New York City in July. We'll see you soon. Daniel Skilton is saying come to Durban, South Africa. So the most beautiful women in the world are from that part of the world, Daniel. Hopefully I'll see you soon. Young Zane says I want the Dons to come to Jamaica. Mitchell would love that one. Now one of our top support bases coming from Australia. We've got Billy, Yum Yum and Kai Thielen, if that's your name mate, uh, from Gold Coast, Australia. Just the name of it sounds nice. Good night, mate. Now this week's question is, who do you think was Essie Don's best signing of 2018 and why? Now remember when you respond, please leave where you are responding from, your country and your city. So who was our best signing in 2018 and why? Comment below. <laughs> No days off. We're saying we're brave. Yes, you're a man of your word, you know. You said you never play for the five. I will never play for the five. Is that why he came in loose for the five? I don't know. Hey, I've got to spot on these holes. Tell us what you think I'm about tonight's result. Really what do you expect from the boys? Yeah, he yeah, talks yeah, more than yeah, Mitch. Yeah, we need you fit. No, we not, need you fit. Not. Daddy working now. <laughs> you should say thank you. Daddy uh, working now. <laughs> big game, big game. <laughs> say it again, Donnie. The connection's shit. <laughs> they didn't want me to come back tonight. So what are you going to do? Okay, okay. I'm going to see you soon. Yeah, man. You know what this club means to us? Anything. Yeah. Yeah? Yes. How'd you recover after games? Get a nice bath. <laughs> a repody shake. My protein. Let's get in my protein. Give me protein. Are you guys ready? Hey, am I that? My protein. Hey, if you want your future, if you want your future, just ask. Anything. Anything. Probably looks like a poor man's J flat. Poor man's J flat. Is SK the new captain? Ask Big G. Don't ever play yourself. What does it take to be a real Don, and why do you deserve to be on the team? What does it take? It takes passion, commitment, and most importantly, loyalty. That's the biggest asset to be a Don's. Listen to the way the boy speaks. He's been raised well. I've done my job right. Loyalty. Last one, yeah. Do you reckon the Don's will become more than a Sunday league team? I don't reckon. I know. And I know it's gonna, that's going to happen because we're all involved in it and you're all involved in it. You're making this club big, so we're going to make this club big. We're See you next global. week. We're going global. Stay positive! <laughs> Come on, you saying bro? Good, yeah. Yeah. Diggers, what you saying? Just trying to do another session, isn't it? Another session. Okay, Mitch was impressed with the performance the last game. Yeah, apparently, apparently. <laughs> fives or Sundays? I'm, I'm not doing it for Mitch. Huh? Five, fives or Sundays? Oh, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Mitch, what are you saying? Nothing, Chris, what are you saying? Fives or Sundays? Both. No, you can only get one. You could only pick one. I'm here at the fives, so it's the fives. They have a small black brother with long hair, and they have quick feet, don't stop running. The two brothers shoot from anywhere. The person is about is the weakest. What's your score predictions today, sir? Oh, I mean, quick five, no, innit? It's calm. It's not dead, quick five. You saying, Riff? Big game, big players, you saying? Yeah, bro, big game, fives, back again. Oh my days, fucking hell, fam. Where's this guy been, fam? Oh, I told shit, him he's been out for a month, we've been scraping. Oh, yeah. I told him, come to the thing, yeah? And um, there's like four boys and he's like, oh, I can't watch the guns, yeah? They stopped, they won't let them come in. They're not letting them. They're not letting them come. They said, no, nah, you can't. Then I've got to go through. They said, excuse me, no, you can't go watch the guns. What are you talking about? <laughs> this is my team. He said, oh, 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 yeah, yeah, you can go. So you come to watch the Dons, yeah? Huh? Dons. But what were you saying? They, they made you pay to come in to watch the Dons? Yeah, man. Anything for the Dons. Anything for the Dons. Now, before we start, 
I'm gonna be greedy. Let's see if we can get 10,000 likes on this five aside video. Just stop it and like it. It's a matter of seconds. Now let's get cracking. All right, then what's happening, people? Welcome back to another episode of the SE Don's Five Aside series. First of all, Happy New Year, Happy Christmas. Um, as you know, these games are actually filmed about two weeks before they come out, two to three weeks, so, uh, as there's a lot of games. So, this was actually shot in 2018, so you're watching the past, but we're gonna focus on the future now. So, here we are, and it's straight away, one nil to them. Scenario. <laughs> So that was International Rem just screaming at the ref because he weren't happy. He thought that the keepers come out of his area. The dude has been taken down. What the f is that? So it's a free kick to the Dons. Uh, to be honest, it looks like Big G was trying to nutmeg the ref or something, but that's a poor uh, free kick. Anyway, ref's been forced backwards and the Greens have done their job. Now some of you call it five aside football. You call it cage football. I'll say it again. Some of you call it five aside football. We call it cage football. So what you've just seen there is the referee pulls a yellow card out of his purse. Big G gets booked, which means he has to spend the next two minutes off of the field in a sin bin. So technically we're down to four players. And uh, International Room hits the deck like Tyson Fury did in round 12 from Wilder. He looks pretty knocked out. Can he get himself back up? Looks like he's out for the count and he's going to eventually come off the pitch. Um, as you can see, the game does continue, but uh, he's walked over. He can't really continue. And he's going to come off in a second and Big Mitch is going to come on. But the ref hasn't stopped the game for some weird reason. So the play continues. They've had a shot. It's we're now only down to three players. And it's Nadi comes forward as a goal. It's gone over the bar. So I can confirm Big G's time is up. He's back on the field. And Mitchell was at the field of players instead of international rim. Riv has a go. Easy pickings. Now, their goalkeeper is known as the Cat. Anyone that plays five aside football will know about him. He's won everything. Very agile keeper. Gets down low and always makes loads of saves. Anyway, it's cage football. That reminds him. It's a foul to them. So, Don still 1 0 down. Keeper rolls diggers as a goal doesn't find him. It's cage football. <laughs> It's not how hard you go down, it's how quick you can get up. What well do I do? So as you can see, five aside football, takes football in South London is very physical. Did you remind But sometimes physicality isn't enough. It's 2-0 to them. We don't so that's the keeper talking about punishment. BDSM talk. So it's more from the opposition. Big guy rolls Big Mitch as a shot. It's the post. Now I know there's going to be comments saying, where's Dolby when you need him? Who needs Dolby when you got that? More from the greens. Collects the ball as a look up, as a shot. Big save from the keeper. Mitch flying. Doesn't go to them. So as you can see, Big G is still out here delivering pizzas. Gives himself a kebab of his own. Come on, come on, man! I remind you, they got the cat, and he's known for clean sheets. However, the Don's still trying to find a break and find a way through. It's international rem as a strike. And it's good block from them. It's come through the diggers. He looks up as I go. He's gone over the bar. Yep, sir. So more hunting from the Dons. They can't hold the ball up top. Comes in his geezer here. He rolls one away and tucks away his lunchbox. <laughs> now by now we've started to realise that their keeper's a few sandwiches short of a picnic. We need to get a goal. And the referee blows his whistle for half time. They're working him. Any chance to shoot, they're, they're, they're popping it. It's fives. Yeah, but stay physical, though. Yeah. yeah, man. Stay physical. Well, when we get physical with them, they're they not getting like, much. They don't like that. Yeah. Yeah, not getting much. Like we got to start working the keeper, man. Yeah. Yeah. You say, Mitch. Mm -hmm. You say, man. Five aside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're done. We're done. We're holding on. So, second half begins. It's cage football. And it's red. And it's greens! I'll be honest, they're calling the cat. 
I'll take it back. Maybe we do need Dolby. I'll be honest, I don't have a clue what the keeper said. He stands about 10 pence short of a pound coin. Big J and happy though. Listen, man. You can't put your hand upon him. I know he frustrate. I know he might look like a pair of Reebok workouts, but this keeper ain't no joke. I won't lie, it's a bad start. So at 6 0 down, we really are playing for pride, huh? Come on, bro. The cat keeps clean sheets. Well, does he? It's cage football. Now I will apologise because it's hard being a referee, man. And players' tempers get flared up. But the referee was in the way here. It stopped them from going forward. He got annoyed about it, and the referee's gonna punish him for it and send him off. Go home to your dinner. Go home to your dinner. Push They don't want us to win. This is what happens. They don't want us to win. We've been here before. So at 6-1, it really has been a turnover to be honest, but at least the boys are showing a bit of hunger and passion. As you can see from that challenge there, it's not just us being aggressive, they are as well. And we're not complaining, it's cage football. Uh, but we're asking if the geezer with a pineapple haircut is going to be sent off as well, as International Rem was, and he's ha he has been. So well done to the ref, and we continue. Cage football! I'll be honest, he's gone past Mitch Easy. Big G's there though. He's got quick He's not He's got done by quick Now the camera, these men are TV go over there, man. So, Big G officially sent off. Rev them. Off the ball action. Diggers or hardcore Holly. That's all good. That's all good. That's So at this moment in time, the Greens are actually trying to play corner football. International Rendo tip corners. Keep the energy Back to the football now. Diggers collects the ball. Can he find some space? He has a go. Cat saves. Come on, come on. Pineapple versus Put Diggers. Diggers. Sit down. Sit down and get up. So with the referee about to call time, it ends 6-2 to the opposing team. Well done to them, congratulations. They were just as physical as we were, it was a real battle and hopefully we'll see them again soon. Make sure you comment below, make sure you like and subscribe. We are on the road to 100,000 subscribers, so we need everyone subscribed. I'm going to see you next week. Apart from the fact they scored good goals, we didn't score enough, ref was appalling. Game management weren't good. Weren't good, game management weren't good. And the boys lost today. Um, win some, you lose some, we show you everything, man. I think it was a fantastic battle, though. The boys showed some heart. Their keeper was an absolute legend. Fantastic player. Well done to them, man. They're there they to celebrate, but it is what it is. We're down to 10 men, or not 10 men, 4 men, or whatever that is. But yeah, man, it was good to be here. I think it was definitely missing Dobbs and JR, but yeah, man. See you next week. Ref was shocking. Game was controlling the ref. Don't could have played a little bit better, but the ref needs to hold the game. Too many, too many bookings. Shocking ref. I've never seen a yellow card in a five-a-side game. Mad. Anything for the dons, man. Anything for family.